Hey guys, today I want to show you how to create this diamond using basic shapes as usual. So when you start up, you want to go to view, go to show grid, then go to view again, go to snap to grid. This will make it easier to make everything precise. And then zoom in a little bit, select your pen tool, go to the middle of one of these squares right here. Then go one and a half to the left, one and a half up, click there, and just make this triangle. So that's the base of the diamond. Now we want to go to this corner and hold down the shift key. If you don't do that, you will delete this point. So hold down the shift key until the star appears. Click one time, release the shift key, then click in the middle of this line, in the middle of this one, and down here. But this shape looks this shape look a little odd. So we want to select these points, go one up, select this point, go two steps to the left and two steps to the right over here. So that will be the outline of our diamond. Now we need to make the details in the diamond. For that we use the line segment tool right here. Click that one, go to the bottom of the diamond, hold and drag. You need to hold down the mouse button and go up here. Make one line there, one line here, one line from the top of this, this line to the corner and the same thing over here. And the last thing you want to do is go from this corner up to the top and down again. Now we got all the details of the diamonds. So now we don't need the borders anymore. You can just delete those, so now you can't see anything, but it's still there. Now we need to color it. I have prepared these swatches for this. You can download these swatches in the link in the description if you don't want to make your own. And when you do that, you get one swatch file, an ASE file, and you can go up here, open swatch library, other libraries, and just select the ASE file from wherever you choose to save it. Then you will get my swatches over here. And you go to the live paint bucket. It will be shape builder tool from the start, but go to live paint bucket. Then select the brightest color to the first triangle. Then just make it darker and darker all the way through like this. Then you need to color the base, but because we have the brightest color here, we don't want the brightest color down here. So we take the next brightest color. And because we got this color, which is this one, we choose every second color, so they don't match. And this will be your diamond. If you want a light version of it, you can just Choose the other color palette over here and you'll get a result like this instead. So these are the two colors you get. Thanks for watching. Please like this video if you want to see more of these, I really appreciate it.